Hi, right, guys. I'm Phil Town from Real One Investing. And today I want to talk to you about how to protect your 401k from a stock market crash. So when it comes to finding stocks on sale, Rule One investors know that a major event like big recession creates a stock market crash. This becomes a golden opportunity for us to buy great companies at really great prices. And basically that results in crushing the market. From 2009 at the last big recession, students who got in when we were talking in class about these, you know, buy these 10 companies in uh, June of 2009, those students turned $100,000 into 1.25 million and a compounded return of 32% per year. Compounded, massive. But what if you have a 401k? What if you can't go out there and buy those individual companies because they treat you like an infant, unlike an IRA or a Roth IRA where you can buy whatever you want. Your 401k ran by your company, they treat you like you're infantile and they're not gonna let you buy individual companies. It's just frustrating as all get out. You're stuck in funds and money markets accounts. Now, why would anybody even do that? Well, two reasons. Number one, they let you have more money in that retirement account than any other kind of retirement account. And number two, companies often match your contribution to at least some level, and that's just free money. So I totally get it. I would never say don't do it, but you might wanna look at a couple things to protect your 401k, especially for coming up on a high, high market record. What can you do to keep yourself from riding that thing down 50%? So first thing is absolutely recognize that the, the advisors that you're going to have are going to tell you to stay in the market and just keep pouring money into that thing. And in the long run, that kind of advice will get you ballpark a seven to nine percent return. And if you started off early enough in your 20s and you keep doing that and you keep grinding out that life and you keep staying on that treadmill and just keep doing the corporate world, you know what? By the time you're 60, 65 years old, you'll probably have a lovely retirement that you can enjoy. Okay, now, what if you don't do that? What if you don't put in the money soon enough? What if you're 45 years old and there's not nearly enough money in that 401k that you can afford to have it go down by 50%? What if you're 60 and man, down by 50%, would just be devastating to your retirement. All right, let me tell you what we do. Now, this isn't advice, this isn't recommendations. This is just to let you know there are tools out there that can definitely help. At least they've worked for a decade, two decades now. They've worked really successfully at getting people through the big crash in 2000, 2001, and the big crash in 2008, 2009. They're very effective so far. I can't say that they're gonna work always in the future, but they've certainly worked in the past. And the result has been by using these tools, those people who use them saw about a three to one return in their 401ks relative to leaving the money and letting it sit there. These tools are called indicators and every single broker out there has dozens of them. We use three proprietary indicators in our own accounts, but you can pick some and just back test them and see what you like, see what works the best with your mutual funds and with the indexes that you're buying. What you should do is put these indicators on a monthly period. And you can look this up in Google and it'll explain it. Put them on a monthly period and do the calculations based on monthly and then run your mutual funds or indexes for the last 20 years and see that if you got out when all these indicators said exit, and then you got back in when they said come back in, then you might see that you did very, very well indeed. That's the best thing I can tell you in order to be out of the market sometime near the top and back in sometime near the bottom. It's not gonna be perfect, but at least you're not gonna sit there just agonizing over watching the market drop by 50%. So I'll tell you what, I'd love to hear from you guys if there's a better way to protect your 401k from a stock market crash. I would love to know it. Let me know. Leave, it, leave a comment with your answer below. And I'll be sure and follow up with you, I promise. And thanks for watching. Now go play.
Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, you think it was valuable in teaching you more about how to protect your 401k in a stock market crash, hit the like button and please share the video with your friends. And if you want more investing content, just subscribe to this channel and don't forget to click the button on the screen. We got a free gift. Thanks again for watching.